Yo, 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 what's up, YouTube, what's up? I want to say thank you to those who subscribe and those who have not subscribed, yo. Hit that button at the bottom, that bell, and it will let you know when I upload the video. I will just add um, a a person's channel, and they had they had Omi on it, <clears throat> and now he's doing things, podcasts, something like that, or he's doing something with a microphone, right? And he said that on December 19th is the indictment, and then he was talking about how... How the IRS and the FBI, you know, they they they're into a battle because you know they they he learned yesterday there were some things that they were wrong at, and this and that. So I bet you come to nineteenth, um, come to nineteenth, he he, it'll be, it'll be probably, oh they didn't want to indict me. Because they didn't have enough evidence, he said that the IRS, you know, wasn't um, they 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 have an uphill battle because of um, because he, he he had everything in the one account, um, and um, and my thing is that I don't know if he's aware, but and whatever he did with gears or whatever he did with reloaded, that's illegal money, so you can't claim that. So I don't know where he got his I don't know where he got his. His theory that the IRS gave you three, they gave him three, that he has three years to, 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 to file for income tax. Yes, you do have three years if you're getting a refund. If you have a refund coming to you, yes, you have, you have three years. But if you owe taxes, if, you, if you're self-employed, and you're self-employed, you have to pay taxes. Because you're receiving cash. And out of that cash you have, that, that cash that you're receiving, you have to pay taxes on that cash. So at the end of the year, when you when you do your W, when you do your your, your 1099 or whatever, or your W two, I mean the night W two, your ten ninety nine or whatever it is, um, you need to to file taxes, and when you file taxes, you have to pay on the money that you got. But I don't know where he's coming from that they got a big for years. No, you file, you file on the day that you file, which is January or February, which is whenever the IRS opens. And you have you have until April twenty second, April fifteenth, or something. I think say April fifteenth to file. Then they then they give you an extension, right? But if you owe the IRS, and they will tell you you owe us X amount of dollars, they're not going to tell you you got three years to pay. No, they won't do that. That's not the way it works. Three years is for those who are owed a refund. Those who are owed a refund, like he said, he had everything in one account. And they're talking about that his money was legit because his money came from a business. Okay, that money from a business, from your, from your, your construction and things that you contracted, that's different from what you got from Gears. So, if you, and, and that money that you made in construction, that money that you made building stuff, and the money that you, anything, anything that, that he received, and he didn't pay taxes on that, and then yes, he's going to get penalized for that. But and then... He's gonna get penalized on on the 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 infringement on the infringement. He's gonna get pen, he, he, he's, he's gonna get penalized on the money laundering because he was that's basically it. He was doing he was getting money on uh, um, illegally. And like I said in my other video, what money laundering is. So I want to see how this case, this so-called case, goes, um, because I've seen. I've seen cases where you know they say, "Well, we're going to, we're gonna, we're gonna do this, we're gonna do that." But my my thing is this, and this is where this is where I'm perplexed. Maybe not you, but I'm perplexed. When a warrant is issued, whether it's a search warrant or for whatever the case may be, FBI, DEA, IRS, whatever. Well, the IRS wouldn't have a search warrant. It would be the FBI, but it can be. But when the FBI or the police come to your house with a search warrant, it will come to your search warrant. They knock on your door and they say, we have a search warrant. This is my search warrant. You see this little beautiful bed, bath, and beyond? This is what it says. This is a search warrant. We have we have the warrant. We have the right to search your premises. And we have the right to search computers. We have the right to remove computers. We have the right to remove everything in your house. They'll, he'll tell you. He, he or she will tell you. And they'll say, here, boom. Here's the warrant. You keep the warrant. They don't take the warrant. You keep the warrant because they already have a copy of the warrant. So you keep the warrant. The warrant is just to show you 
and to give it to you so that, that you could know that they really went to a judge. The judge found reasonable cause. I mean, reasonable, uh, reasonable cause to give them a warrant to search your home because there was legal illegal activities uh, for whatever, whatever, whatever reason. So they search your house, but you keep your search warrant. You keep that. What you do, you don't go on to... You don't go on to, 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 to YouTube and say, hey, listen, I just got searched. I mean, blah, blah, this, blah, blah. No, what you do with your search for, you call your lawyer. Yo, man, I got the FBI in my house, man. They're taking everything, man. What I do, man, if they got a search, what does the search warrant say? The search warrant says they got this, 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 that. Well, listen, you know what? This is what the lawyer said. You know what? Don't say anything to nobody. Let me handle this. Do not record anything. Don't make any, don't make any statements. Just let me, just let me handle this. I'll take care of this. And that's it. Simple. So I, what I want to see is this. I want to see this. Your warrant. Your search warrant. Okay. I saw the other day some cars getting told. I don't know what state it was. And they, and it was told by the FBI and the IRS. I mean, the, yeah, but by the FBI and the IRS. And they were, they were people who was, is, is, is there's, there's people who were, there were people who were, People who were um, getting their, um, there were people who were recording the 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 IRS removing cars and the IRS moving it, and you saw a whole bunch of them with IRS jackets, and you saw a bunch of them with the FBI jackets, right? Nothing, none of that you saw at Omi's, right? You only saw you only saw blurs, blurs, okay, blurs. That's it. Listen, nothing can. You didn't see the whole when when they come, they come indeed. They didn't see, you didn't see no FBI here, no FBI. They, they don't come when it says FBI. You know, they, nothing, none of that. But still, no warrant, right? So, and then, so then today, so today another thing happened, right? Today there was a shootout in New Jersey, right? And six people died, unfortunately. Um, four civilians died. The officer passed away. He was shot, shot in the head, and then three civilians died in the store. The suspects, they were killed. I'm not interested in them. I'm not interested in those. My, my condolences go to the family of the, of the of the innocent. But everybody was recording. Everybody and their mother, even even as the shot, if you see the TV, even as the shots, the shots were being fired, people are still recording. They don't give a shit. Hey, look, look, look. They were still recording. Every, everyone that you saw running had a camera, had a, had a camera in their hand. But Omi got, Omi got, Omi got towed, right? He got, he got seized in that one camera. You tell me that. With a neighborhood where you see, if you see his address, everybody in there has camera. And even, even, even with the camera, even with, even if they have a camera, someone along that road, because if there were so many cars along that road, Someone would have recorded. Ooh, wow, look at this, look at this, look at this. And everybody, and so people know Omi, right? They say, oh, those cars are coming from Omi's house. Well, wow, it's recorded. What's going on with Omi? Well, yo, go Omi. Well, come on, man. So I want to see this indictment. I want to see this December 19th indictment because I, I believe he's going to say, with the, with the comments that he made today, that they have an uphill battle, that it's not going to be easy for them and stuff like that. I think he's going to keep, but he probably end up coming out. He end up coming out with a, with a oh, they're not going to indict me. The grand jury has decided not to indict me because they have insufficient evidence. Okay. So, um, I don't know if his indictment is a secret indictment. I don't know how he, I don't know how he knows he's going to get indicted. Um, but normally, when you get indicted, you do have a choice. You do have a chance to go to the indictment to. To defend yourself. The only bad thing about you going to your indictment and defending yourself is that everything you say can't everything anything you can say will be held against you. So if you say something at your indictment and one and if it goes to trial, you have to say the same thing that you said in trial an indictment. If not, then you purge yourself. And if you've been to jail and if you've been to prison. On your, indi on, on your indictment when you sit down, because your lawyer don't speak, it's the prosecutor. The prosecutor will say, you know what, have you been arrested before? You've been, you've been arrested? Yes, 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 yes. And that right there, the grand jury is going to say, well, he's guilty. 
And I don't pay too much attention to indictments because anyone can get indicted. A cat can get indicted. Because indictment is they pick several people from the streets. They, they pay them, I don't know how much they pay now, just to sit there an hour or two, listen to, to, to a story that they, they know nothing about. And then they decide if they, okay, this, 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 we, you have enough evidence to, 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 for an indictment. So anyone can get indicted. Anyone. So it doesn't mean that you're in good trouble, you get indicted, blah, blah, because anyone can get in trouble. Anyone can get, anyone can get indicted. It doesn't mean nothing. Indictment means nothing. All right, so that to me doesn't surprise. But I do want to see. But when you do get, when you do get indicted, you do get a piece of paper. Okay, saying what you're indicted for. That I would like to see if this thing goes to the 19th, or he's just says, hey, "I don't know, man. I just uh, I won the case. You know, the IRS had nothing on me. The 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 the, the thing didn't have anything on me. And at the end of the day, he you know he keeps saying that the IRS just wants to recoup." But you can't recoup from money that you made from an illegal activity, from an illegal crime. You can't. They're not going to recoup that because they can't get money from that because it's illegal. You, a drug dealer can't file income tax because dealing drugs. So the IRS can't go off of that drug dealer and say, you know what, you sold drugs, you made $20 million, so you got to give me something. Like, no, because it's illegal. You made the money illegally. So that's not going to happen. And if you had, and if you had, legitimate, if you had legitimate business... And you didn't pay for the taxes, and then that, that's a whole that's a whole different ball game. That's a whole different ball game. You're not looking at millions of dollars in it. You're not looking at millions of dollars in 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 in, in, in fines because I, I, I'm only assuming you know the, the little jobs that you got. Maybe you you, you did a job for ten thousand dollars here, twenty thousand dollars there, thirty thousand dollars here. You have to pay overhead. You have to pay material. All the person pays material, but you have to pay. You know you gotta pay your your, your workers. You know you gotta you gotta. There's a lot of things. So it's not just that. But going back to the topic, I would like to see that search warrant. That's the one thing I would like to see. And come the 19th, indictment or no indictment, I would like to know what happens. And if he gets indicted, I would like to see that piece of paper. If he shows that piece of paper, then I'll say, you know what, people, then I apologize. But I'm not going to, I'm not going to apologize if he shows me an indictment stating that, that he got indicted because he didn't pay taxes on his business. No, 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 no. Because this has nothing to do with his business. I would say sorry if he, if they, they, he said that that, that he got in, that he didn't get indicted that, that he got indicted because of copyright infringement, money laundering, the money that he made from from gears and reloaded whatever was illegal. Okay, that's what I want to do. And if and if and if and if reloaded is shut down, why is what is it? Um, Mega TV on Omega TV is on on his on the Reloader site. So if that was shut down, simple man. I mean, and he's saying hating and stuff. Like, he's not gonna mention my name, but he's saying hating and stuff like that. This is this ain't hate, man. I'm good, man. I'm good with any man is doing good, man. You don't know how proud I am when I see a Hispanic man come from here to here, or when a black man goes from here to here. Because we have been, we have been shackled so much that we can't do this, that we can't do that. We have been told by society that we can't be do this, we can't do that because we are second class citizens. Because we don't belong here. Because America is not ours. America belongs to the Indians. All right, we're all foreigners here in this country. Our great great grandparents came here from another country. So that that's this is this is our country because we were born here. But to say that you're lesser, that I'm lesser than you because your skin color or your your blue eyes, no. So I feel good when I see my brother or sister rise, and I give them compliments. I say, "Yo, that's the way to go," and it thrives and it makes me want to go more. It made me want to be, you know, well, yeah, he could do it, I could do it. Okay. But I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna. There's, there's, there's nothing positive with Omi. There isn't. He said, though, they, they treated me like if I'm a fucking criminal. Fuck, you are a criminal. You're a white collar criminal. You did a service. You're, 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 you're selling a service that you're not supposed to be selling. That doesn't belong to you. And you're profiting from it. So you are a criminal. Plain and simple. 
Just because you're doing a white collar crime does not mean you're not a criminal. So that 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 exempts you from being a criminal. Come on, bro. It is what it is. You're a criminal. Your record shows from the past that you were a criminal. Whether you got caught in containers because you're a criminal, criminal. You did. It, it, it doesn't have to be your murder or rape or anything. That like you were a criminal. So just because you're doing you're doing a white collar crime, that doesn't make you a criminal because you say, "Oh, you're not hurting nobody." Yeah, you're hurting. You're hurting the the company who's making who, who who's supposed to get that money. You're hurting their revenues. Okay, maybe those people that are saving money are saving money because they you know they don't have to pay high cable bills stuff like that. But you're hurting. You're hurting the ones that are are. You're hurting the ones that were making the money. You're hurting the ones that are producing it because they're not getting that. They're not getting back the money they're supposed to. Um, the actors, all right, and just in just just in case for all you IPTVers out there that are doing these IPTV and you go and you go into these accounts knowingly that these are illegal accounts. It's going to be trust me when I say this. When Disney rises, when when, when Disney put Disney Plus. And when Disney find when Disney not finds out when when Disney knows that they're being pirated, they are going to go after. And one of the things that Disney will do, trust me, this is going to happen, or any other major company is going to do, is that they're going to prosecute, or they're gonna not them, but they will they they will force the hands of prosecutors to go after those who paid for IPTV because you're paying for IPTV. You cannot say you didn't know it was illegal. You cannot say that. So they're going to go after these people. They're going to go after you one day. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but in the future, they're going to go after you. Because if they can't go after you, they, they're trying to get, you know, that's why they send you out these, these letters for see, um, to, to, to the cease, to stop and cease because they want you to stop. They're giving you a break. Yo, stop doing this. Stop doing this. But when, you, when you're, not, now you're not doing it, you're forcing the hands. So there's going to come a time, they're gonna, you know what? All these people, this is what I would do. This is how you. This is how you deter IPTV forever. Simple, plain and simple. I would not go after the person who's doing the IPTV. I'll go after the person who subscribed to the IPTV. Because once that person knows, I gotta get my information. I gotta get my credit card. I gotta get this information. Okay. You're dead out of luck. You can't say that. You can't say that. You didn't know that was illegal because you know that was illegal. Like I said before, IPTV is not illegal. IPTV is completely legal. Streaming your IPTV to someone else and selling it, it's illegal. Streaming it to someone else, even if it's for free, it's still illegal. Okay? But that's what I would do. If I was if I was a prosecutor, if I was an owner of a company, I would say, you know what, I'm not gonna go after them. I'm gonna go after I'm gonna go after the people who are buying the service. And those are the people that, that you go after. And you go will see. It, 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 even if you bought a prepaid card, that prepaid card will show that it was you, because you will leave a trace. No matter what you do, you will leave a trace. You may think not, but you will, and that's how you get caught. So if you pay thirty five dollars a month or twenty dollars a month for a year, get any service for this channel and this channel, and this channel. So you know what? I'm going to charge you ten thousand dollars. Well, I don't got no money. Well, that's not my fault. And then what's going to happen? So if you don't have ten thousand dollars when you when you get sued, you might not you you might not get you might not get you might not even get in trouble. But you have you're gonna have a lien on your house, a lien on your car, a lien on anything that you own. If you get any future earnings, you get any you win the lotto, you win anything, or you get anything anything earnings, income tax, whatever, woof, it's garnished. So here you are, you're waiting for a, a ten thousand dollar income tax return. Ooh, that's gonna be doing me good. And all of a sudden, woof. Nine thousand is away, taken away because you owe these people, and they have that right to garnish you. If they win by court, they have that right to garnish you. So, be careful, people. IPTV, you got Pluto TV that's free. There's there's a lot of IPTVs out there that are free. Yeah, I'm like from another country, but, like, but Pluto TV is, is it's getting good. They they just got bought by by like like I said, by Viacom and Viacom just joined CBS last week. So they're 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 putting good contest to that, and it's a free it's it's a free it's a free app, you know. So I suggest if you do stick to I you can say if you do IPTV over there, just still stick to Cody. Get the get the 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 add on the, the add ons. Get a build and stick with that. Get yourself a VPN. 
and stick with that. Stick with a good, good build that's getting built that, that every other day is being updated every other day. Blah, blah, blah. I got a build that I put down on my, on my, that I've been having it for two years now, and I've never had a problem. Got my VPN, never had a problem. And I bet you don't use it. So I don't even really use VPNs because I'm some, on certain cable companies, they, they block you. So I use VPN, but when I when I go to another cable company that I know I can use, I don't I don't use I don't use a VPN because they cannot tell me anything for streaming from Cody. I'm streaming, I'm not downloading. Cody is an open source. So I can stream from Cody and watch whatever I want. But when I download it, that's when they find out, hey, listen, you downloaded this movie, blah, 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 blah. So there is no gray area in that and stuff like that. But, I, but like I said, I want to see the warrant. I want to see the warrant. And people who are out there saying Haiti, blah, blah, blah. No, no. I'm down with them when the, a Puerto or a Hispanic goes up and rises to the top as well as a black man goes up and rises to the top. Because we got to stop this mentality that white man won't let us do this. No, no, no. We could do it. If, you, if we put our mind and dedication to it, we could do anything that we want to do. Trust me. I can tell you because... Slowly but slowly, I'm becoming a success story. I don't want to be rich because that, that's not my style. And if I became rich, most of my money, I would say 90% of it would go to poor. Because I know how it is to be poor. I'm still poor. I don't have nothing. But as long as I have my health, as long as I have God, as long as I have my family, that's all that matters. I don't want to get out. I don't want to be rich. The rich money brings problems. The less I have, the better off I am. As long as I can pay my bills and I can do this, I can, and I can take a vacation once in a blue moon, that's what I care about. You know? And when I do have extra money, I give out. I give this. I pay this. I do a sandwich here. I pay this one there. Blah, blah, blah. I don't mind. But I do feel proud when I see someone from our race, whether Puerto Rican, Dominican, Mexican, whatever, and they bust their ass and they made it. That, to me, is a success story. Like, I, I saw this man... Mexican, he came from Mexico. He worked for a truck company. Now he owns a truck company. That's success. All right? You come and you work for a McDonald's, and now you own a McDonald's. That's success. All right? You come and you're working in a florist shop, floor shop, now you own a florist shop. That's success. Okay? But doing IPTV and selling IPTV things and blah, 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 that's not success because... You're stealing, and that's what you're doing. You're stealing. So how could that? How can stealing be a success? How can you admire that? Can't. I, well, I don't. Well, guys, yo, have a good time. You guys keep asking me for Omi videos. You guys keep sending me things. I forget about Omi, and you guys keep sending me, and I keep looking at him. I don't go to his channel because, like, it's true what he says. You go to his channel for every view, you know, he gets paid. So let him come out to his channel. Let somebody else take it, and you just watch it. Don't 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 give him something. You know what I'm saying? He is making revenues out of uh, out of the views. So, well, be, yo, I gave you guys whenever you guys whenever you guys watch this video, enjoy it. Um, I posted a video of a TV that I bought today. Um, so, hope you guys like it. All right? So, I want to say peace to everybody else out there. All right? So, thanks.